Mama. Please take it easy. I ain't saying that you need me. <laughs> what's good guys it's your boy tyson here back again with another video and i know i've been gone for like a year but it's cool because i'm back now so <laughs> i'm gonna just take you guys through my sunday i'm about to go to walmart to buy some food to meal prep because i was supposed to do it yesterday but i did nothing yesterday and i was in bed all day trash but today it's a new day. So yeah, I'm about to pull up to Walmart, get my stuff, and then I'm gonna show y'all what I eat. So it's gonna be a good, productive day. All right, so I just got done. There's a glare in these glasses, I gotta take them off. Oh no, I'm ugly, let me put them back on. So I just got done shopping. Now I'm gonna show you guys what I actually bought. Um, and just so y'all know, this is like for the week's worth cause I used to shop like for like two weeks in advance, but I found that food is not as good when you make it a week before cause it's trash. I don't recommend it. So I got, you already know, the chicken. The chicken. Um, <laughs> Uh, next, I bought some good old sweet peas, you know, just as like a um, entree, is that what they call it? Entree, side dish to the chicken. I put this in the microwave for about six minutes and it's good, it's good, it's really good. But I put salt on it cause like, I'm not gonna lie, it's bitter bro, it's like, I don't know. I love peas, but like this is just, needs a little bit of seasoning if you know what I mean. I always buy brown rice, but I got some at the house. So I, I didn't buy it today, but it's at the house. With the brown rice, I actually do cook that because I found that like buying them in cups is like way more expensive. Yeah, it's like $2 compared to like 75 cents for a two pound bag. So your boy is trying to save some money. So yeah, it's at home, but I'm gonna show you all though. Uh, so yeah, what I typically eat is uh, grilled chicken, brown rice and vegetables that's literally what i tell everybody that i eat when they ask me my diet i cannot tell you how many times people have asked me what my diet was and that's what i say lean meat brown rice uh and vegetables and lifting that's how, simple but not done um next i got the good old whey protein yes a uh, six star Typically for the whey protein, I um, I drink a shake for breakfast because I'm not really too big on breakfast because I'm just not. Um, and I uh, take it in between my meals and then after my workout, of course, because that's the most important time you should take whey protein is after your workout because all your muscles are depleted and this is how you refuel your muscles. And my hood keeps falling off. Can you stay, stay on? on? Thank you. All right, uh, but yeah, good source of protein as well, obviously. Uh, next. Um, this is just some extra stuff that I buy because I love to snack. I love snacks. If you know me, you know I love snacks. Uh, I love cereal. Cascadian Farm is where it's at. This time I got oats and honey. I love all their flavors, but you know, oats and honey is where it's at for real. Um... Obviously, I eat this for breakfast sometimes, but most of the time I'm taking my whey protein shake. Uh, but yeah, good source of goodness. Um, Cliff Bars, Cliff Bars, Cliff Bars, Cliff Bars. I love Cliff Bars. Um, white chocolate macadamia nut. I also love the peanut butter. I get that all the time. Um, but yeah, this is a good snack in between my meals when i'm hungry and i'm hungry 24 7 so good source of goodness as well um but honestly this stuff is extra like you don't have to buy this like this is just what i buy oh and i oh oh pause oh my god y'all see that booger in my nose it was there the whole time 
I didn't even see it until I zoomed in. Uh. Oh! That's what I buy. Um, I'm gonna go back home, show you guys what I'm gonna eat for breakfast today, and then I'm gonna cook my food, eat that, and then pull up to the gym, and then show y'all my back and biceps workout. So, this man is staring at me. Still staring at me. Okay, I'm a, I'm a go. I'm a, I'm uncomfortable. All right, but yeah, I'm a, I'll be back. <clears throat> All right, so I just got back from Walmart, and I'm gonna get eat my breakfast. Um, or well, breakfast. It's just my whey protein shake with a cliff bar and yeah chocolate is the best But yeah, yeah, this is my first meal of the day. Um, after I finish this, I'm going uh, to make my chicken, brown rice, and vegetables to eat. Then crush that and then go to the gym and get my swole on, you feel me? <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. I need to stop. I don't know why I'm like this. I need to stop. But yeah, I'll be back. So I just finished cooking, you know what I'm saying? I got the, can't see it, okay. Got the rice, got the peas, got the chicken, with a little bit of sweet sauce, a little bit of pineapple marinade, you feel me? Cause I felt fancy. I felt fancy. But yeah, I'm gonna tear this up, then go to the gym, kill it, and then yeah. All right, so the time is now 3.30 and I think I'll know what time it is. I think I'll know. Back and biceps. I'm gonna show y'all what I do. Show y'all how I get down. Wait. How I get down in the gym. Yes, I'm excited. And you should be too. <laughs> But yeah, I'm doing back and biceps today, and then I'm gonna call it a day, you know. It's been good being with you guys so far, it's been fun, it's been really fun. I love it, love it, love it. But yeah, I'm gonna see y'all at the gym. As y'all know, before every workout, you have to warm up, have to. So I'm starting off with the easy bar curl with three sets of 12 just to get the biceps, you know, a little warmed up, a little tingly. <laughs> weight 35 pounds to each side and i am doing 12 reps slow and controlled slow and controlled okay okay Now 
for the second and third set, I added five pounds, so it's 40 pounds on each side. In case you can't math, I got you. And I'm doing eight to 10 reps. And as you can see, I'm already struggling and the workout just started. That's embarrassing. So next is a superset. And just in case you guys forgot what a superset was, it's when you perform two workouts after each other with no rest at all. So the first workout is going to be the reverse grip lat pull down. And we're doing three sets of 10 to 12 reps. And really what this workout does is it works out the lower portion of your lats. And as you can see, I'm holding it down at the bottom for about three seconds and I'm going back up slow. And then right after that is the close grip lat pull down. Three sets of 10 reps. The same notion going slow on the way down and on the way up. So next is what I call the dumbbell bicep curl drop set. And for those of you who have no clue what a drop set is, it's when you drop weight. So as you can see, I'm starting with 40 pounds and I'm doing eight to 10 reps, slow and controlled. After that, I went down five pounds and I'm doing this weight until failure. And for those of you who don't know what failure is, it's just lifting the weight until you can't no more, basically. And then right after that, I went down five pounds again and then did that to a failure. And I did this whole circuit for three sets. Next is the one arm dumbbell row and I did three sets of 12 reps for each arm.
then last but not least, we have our hammer curl holds, which is the finisher to this workout. So as you can see, I'm holding the dumbbells at a 90 degree angle and I'm bringing one arm down and then back up while I still hold the other arm up. What this does is it keeps contraction on the biceps at all times. So I'm doing 10 reps for each arm. shredded <laughs> that's the end of the workout i hope you guys enjoyed it and please like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video